like the video and subscribe if you love Roblox. Hey yo, what is going on guys? My name is Illusions Ghost and welcome back to another video guys and inside of this video we are back inside of build a boat for treasure roblox once again guys so anyway if you guys are all new to the channel make sure you guys also smack that like button subscribe and of course turn on those notifications guys and inside of this video we are actually going to be going over three secrets you may have missed inside of build a boat for treasure so make sure you guys all stay tuned for that guys so you guys don't miss a single thing and without further ado let's jump straight into this video so the first secret we actually have to show is the shovel guys and you guys probably are like bro what the heck do you mean by the shovel and i will explain everything in just one second also make sure you guys watch the, uh, the entire video because you're not going to want to miss these secrets twice now are you so basically guys the shovel the shovel was something that was really really big back almost a whole year ago or like 10 months ago guys actually inside of the halloween update inside of build a boat for treasure all right so this shovel was actually um given to you so you can actually dig up dig spots around the map and even inside of this cool little event, there was actually a secret within it. So as you can see, you can actually use this shovel to try to dig up stuff. And when you actually dig up stuff, you get free items, guys. So the majority of the items that you end up actually getting are usually candies. All right, as you can see, I got the red candy inside the last clip. And inside this one, I actually got the pink one. Okay, so yeah, there are only basically candies that you can actually get from this. But the inside of the secret, inside of this that I was actually talking about earlier, um, there is actually something much much better that you can actually get so as you can see noob illusions ghost is actually heading over here to this secret temple all right and as you can see um when i actually pull out this shovel i haven't done any of the quests guys this is not even supposed to be like a big thing okay so this is actually supposed to be a secret so i'm pretty sure it was first found out by chill Thrill himself as you can see this or not chill Thrill, but by liege north okay as you can see this is where the first one actually is and this is actually what i'm doing right here i'm simply just clicking right in front of this pyramid not where it says where i should click and i actually get a a free dragon harpoon guys now this actually was a free robux item guys so this is a big big deal and the reason for that is is because it's a robux item and you don't even have to spend robux to get it like are you serious okay so there are a bunch of of these little spots all right as you can see this this is actually the correct location and again i get candies but um if there's actually more locations around the map where I'm actually able to dig up and actually get more dragon harpoons, guys. Now, this actually has allowed me to get 63 harpoons dragon harpoons guys that's more harpoons like this is, i almost have okay well not not counting these harpoons because i have 600 and you know 78 of these because you know i bought a lot of chests all right but these are actually robux items and i have 63 of them without really spending that much robux on them and the cool thing about these things is that they actually have a homing feature to them so like if i'm if i'm like running diagonally and i try to shoot it at myself okay what it'll do it'll actually curve to actually hit me in the head so yeah that is actually a really really cool feature also the whole shovel idea as well that was a great idea by chill throw all right so chill throw keep keep up the good work with that sort of stuff the next secret that we actually have is the rb battles event so as you can see this is the rb battles event and right here you can see these giant um what, what are they called giant bottles around the waterways okay so basically what we were supposed to do was we had to not only figure out this code which i figured out on my own okay so i was like probably one of the first people to figure out the code you guys maybe i wasn't the first person to actually get into the room and actually get the sword and actually defeat the boss and everything like that but to figure out the code i was one of the first people to actually figure that out and you guys honestly should have heard my reaction to actually figuring out the code like i i like um pressed the final book and then i was like <gasps> 
Wait, oh, nope, that was nothing. And then, it, and then it actually was something, I started freaking out. All right, it was honestly super, super funny. But yeah, what we were supposed to do was actually go around and actually find these bottles, and it actually told us what color to actually put on these little stands. As you can see, it's all jumbled up because we had no idea what it was actually so, supposed to be at that time. But eventually we turn everything green, which actually allows us to flick this lever. So this lever right here, guys, actually opens up this portal right here which sends us into a boss battle and then we actually have to survive for such a long time and then upon beating this um boss right here you actually get the blue sword in the rb battles event so why this was such a big deal is because the rb battles is a huge roblox event that actually has to do with tons of different Roblox games, guys. So, build boat was lucky enough to have one of the swords inside of it. All right, one of only three swords inside of it. I think Picky had another one, and like Robeats had another one, guys. So, this honestly was a really, really big deal for build boat guys. All right, and I can't, I just can't believe that build boat was a part of it, and that I was actually a part of it in trying to solve this thing. Now, the last secret we actually have today is actually the Fobby boss inside of build a boat for treasure guys so this boss was also very very hard to get to not as hard as the last one guys not by a long shot but this one was still also very hard to actually get to not only did you have to find this secret room which honestly took um, me Jesse and fusion like 10 hours to actually find just continuously playing build a boat to actually find this thing but you also had to figure out some code on the piano which couple hours guys all right then you had to make your way to yet another secret and actually find the black key which then you guys were actually able to open up the door to fight this boss and upon completing this boss you will get some free gold some bread and of course the fobby plushie so I, for one, think that is actually one of the best updates inside of build boat for history. And also, you can still fight this boss if you guys really, really do want to. All you guys need is an executor. I'm saying that, like, all you guys need. But, all right, um, or you could be inside of a game with somebody with an executor, guys. So, basically, you know, I would say be careful if you're going out to get your own executor. Because a lot of them actually do have malware. So, um, just be very, very careful. Also, if you do end up getting an executor, try not to you know exploit too much um, to try to like ruin the game for other people and stuff because that's just no fun to them but anyway guys hope you guys all did enjoy this video if you guys did like and subscribe and turn on those notifications and I hope to see you guys all inside of the next video also beware of executors they could have a virus or malware in them so be careful all right I don't condone them but if I can't stop you from using it so if you do use it be careful anyway see you guys on the next video love you guys all peace out and goodbye